first Mortal Kombat, Deception. Big Trouble in Little Tokyo in Godzilla Save the Earth. And mature ratings get a little more mature in Blood Rain 2. Cover the baby's eyes. It's game time. Welcome to people just phoning it in, Adam Sessler and Morgan Webb. Hello and welcome to x -Play, the show that brings you video game reviews and promos with the guy who screams this. I hate Adam Sessler. Yep, I'm tired of that too. On today's show, we celebrate violence, glorious violence. Why? Because we have a review of one of the biggest fighting games of the year, Mortal Kombat Deception. Oh, fatality's not violent enough for you? How about a fighting game that stars the king of all monsters, Godzilla? Plus, the first fully 3D King of Fighters game. Some very special moments with the Soul Calibur 2 fighters. And last but not least, the sexiest vampire in video games returns. That's right, we review Blood Rain 2, what may be the most violent video game we've played all year. I think it's actually gorier than PsyOps. But we began with the latest chapter in the fighting series that first sparked debates about video game violence. Mortal Kombat. Yes, when the first Mortal Kombat came out in 1992, we knew it would redefine video game violence by spelling the word combat with a K. <sighs> now, the latest chapter in Mortal Kombat is hitting all three major consoles. Here's our review of Mortal Kombat Deception. Earthrealm's last hope for freedom. Champions of Earthrealm, you are needed once more to defeat the fugly denizens of Outworld. And I mean fugly with the capital FUG. We return to the world of spelling errors <clears throat> in Mortal Kombat Deception. Fight. No, I don't want to. Fight. Can we just agree to disagree? <laughs> you have got serious aggression issues, dude. <laughs> The deadly fist fighting continues, but as we all know, the real fun doesn't start until the final blow lands on your opponent's shattered face. The amount of ways you can die a horrible death continues to grow. Aw, did you lose? Are you so mad you could crush your own head? Suicidality. Did you stand too close to the chopper blades with no discernible function? Environmentality. I love ham. Thank you very much. Hamality. Why just beat people up in a regular fight when you can beat them up in puzzle combat? Or on a chessboard? Conquest is also massively expanded in Mortal Kombat Deception. And of course, it's spelled with a K. Does no one in Outworld have a dictionary? Honestly, Conquest is an open environment adventure game filled with side quests and hidden items. RPGality. Don't worry, you won't have to give up punching people for long. The real meat of the game is still the fighting. And all the old favorites are here. The combat is furious and bloody. You will need all of your skills to defeat these cheap ass jerks. Or you can just puke at them. Oh, yeah, and there's online play. Yes, sweet, sweet online play. Onlineality. Mortal Kombat Deception performs a fatality on mediocrity and pushes the franchise farther than ever before. Combat is back with style. Mortal Kombat Deception murders its way to a four out of five. It doesn't suck out the battle chess in this game is surprisingly entertaining. Yes, it's good to know that even the most cerebral activities can be pleasantly cheapened by adding senseless violence. Now, of course, Mortal Kombat Deception is one of the biggest fighting games released this year. But last year, the biggest and best fighting game was Soul Calibur 2. Of course, it's been a year. So what exactly are the Soul Calibur characters up to now? Well, I found out what happened to one of them. X-Play presents Stupid Fun with Soul Calibur. So, I've never been on a blind date before. Take this! Oh, thanks. What can I get you to? You know, I'll just have a salad. 
That's all? I'm disappointed. Oh, well, I had a late lunch. And for the pirate? I will feast on your soul. <laughs> so, what do you think about the election? Pray while you can. There you go. Anything else? Your soul makes a poor meal. Keep the check handy. <laughs> Come with me to hell! <laughs> <laughs> Offer your soul to me. What is it with you in souls? Come on, show me. Oh. Oh. Boy, look at the time. Taste my pain! Uh, no thanks, I'm done. You can finish it. Shut up! Look, the pirate thing, it's kind of working for you. But those dead soulless eyes of yours one day will make some <sighs> other lady very, very happy. But you and me, um, I don't think we're gonna work out. Bye-bye. Ah, familiar cries. Now, come back to me! Come back to me. I don't think she's coming back. Shut up! I think the pirate liked you. I didn't like the pirate. He grunts too much. Okay. Ah, in the show, we have our review of Blood Rain 2, the goriest game of the year. But first, we catch up with another famous monster, Godzilla. His hobbies include crushing buildings, eating buses, and irradiating Tokyo. Oh, and destroying other monsters in his new game, Godzilla, Save the Earth. Greetings, pathetic Earthlings. That's right. Never before has the Earth deserved a saving like the one Godzilla and his brawny pals have come to deliver. Godzilla Save the Earth turns our expansive urban carpeting into tiny, destructible parking lots where men in monster suits come to settle the score. The game shoots for authenticity of the that's a guy in a monster suit variety. You'll start with a paltry sprinkling of monsters to play. The game promises more once you've accumulated enough demon dollars to buy them. Beat! And how does one go about earning the aforementioned bling of the beast? By competing in endless tournaments and challenges, of course. And it takes forever. Trying to shoot down the UFOs before they destroy the Trans-American building emphasizes the futility of the game's aiming system. And what giant monster game would be complete without Virilium Basketball? You can also do your own wacky version of the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Cities are sketches of their former selves. Witness smells like Paul Allen Spirit Seattle. Hey, look out for my Jimi Hendrix sock collection. New York, Tokyo, San Francisco, and most real of all, Space Town. As you can see, poor graphics at times make the game into an indecipherable, chaotic melange of trembling pixels. The monster's trademark howls are true to form complimenting the game's nostalgic appeal. For those interested in further study of these great creatures, there's also a Discovery Channel-like glimpse into their secret mating habits. Farige! You tell Angiris he can't get married in your state. When the dust of a world that deserves this second coming is settled, there's really very little to get excited about except the addition of a few more monsters. The cry from Godzilla's lipless mug is a two out of five. Why did Godzilla mate with the giant moth? I don't know, but I do liken it to that time that Julie Roberts married Lyle Lovett. No one knows what that was about. Now well, relationships are confusing, especially when they end. Ooh, I remember that time I broke up with my last celebrity girlfriend. Yeah. Mm -hmm. X-Play presents Stupid Fun with Soul Calibur. Look. I, I don't know how to say this. Don't say anything. I think you're a great person, but this just isn't working anymore. Think about what you're doing. Why does that sound like a threat? <coughs> please, 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 don't cry. Gods, please give me strength. Are you sober? I'm getting closer. One step at a time. Look, I'm glad you went to get help. <sighs> May the gods be praised. When did you get so religious? <coughs>
Look, look, just, just, just don't go drink any Kool-Aid, okay? I will go where the gods guide me. And I'm gonna go wherever you aren't. Pain. It's painful, isn't it? You're talking to a man who stabled himself in the crotch once, so don't go talking to me about pain. I must for the children's sake. Children? What children? Did you hear me? I stapled myself in the crotch. <laughs> Hephaestus, protect us. I'm going to hang Rathion, up now. Rathion, see me through. Who the f is Rathion? <gasps> I didn't know you dated a fictional Viking princess. Well, I didn't know you went on a date with a zombified pirate. Well, there's a lot you don't know about me. Like what? Like I'm about to introduce a commercial break. Um, I knew you were going to do that. Really? Yeah, it's written in the teleprompter. Words. Oh. Coming up, sometimes violence is the answer in King of Fighters Maximum Impact. I'm Morgan Webb. Uh, I'm actually the host of X Play, and my favorite episode is the musical episode. We were up until all hours of the night trying to get that perfect, and I really enjoyed the results. Power, Power. eternal light, light. And a castle in the sky. Oh. Crimes are an unfortunate part of our society. The field of criminal justice is full of men and women, both in the public eye and behind the scenes, working to secure our future. The ITT Technical Institute School of Criminal Justice teaches the fundamentals of the criminal justice system and criminal justice skills. Graduates may be ready to pursue a broad spectrum of careers in the private sector, as well as entry-level positions involving criminal justice, including parole and probation, community corrections and court systems. Be one of the many dedicated Americans who participate in making our nation a better and safer place for us all. ITT Technical Institute School of Criminal Justice, education for the future. To find out more, call 1-800-372-4052 or visit us on the web. Don't miss the number one phenomenon that is record-breaking and history-making. Batman has no limits. Experience the Dark Knight. Ready PG-13, now play. What if I told you there's a quick and easy way to get today's most popular stuff for free? All you need is internet access. Answer a few questions, then tell us where to send your free gift. It's fast, it's easy, and it's real. Thousands of people have already claimed their free gift. I thought it was too good to be true. Then I got my free Xbox. I got a free Xbox for my son. An offer like this doesn't come around every day. Check out the website now and get your free gift. Nowadays, you gotta have plastic. That's where a green dot comes in. You don't even need a bank account. You can use it anywhere. You can use Visa or MasterCard. You load it so you control it. It's a MasterCard or Visa debit card. No overdraft fees, no penalties. It's easy to get. Easy to use. Stop online. Get all those TV offers. Get cash from ATMs. Pay bills over the phone. With my green dot card. It's a lot safer than walking around with cash. You lose your card? Green dot gives you back all the cash you lost. It protects my money. Green dot prepaid reloadable MasterCard and Visa card. Available at your neighborhood stores. Excuse me, miss. Yeah, what can I get you guys? Yeah, we need a woman's opinion. Yeah, see, we say the first thing a woman notices about a guy is his shoes. Mm -hmm. And you're all wearing Skechers. Nice. Wow. Yeah, I told you. Oh, well. And then? For me, personality. Which means you two guys are in trouble. Oh. Nice. So, where do you think this guy should be? I'd say this way. And let's make sure that sound effect we used in the last level fits in here, too. This one? Yeah. You know... I'm so glad I got into game design. It's cool to be able to create the kind of games that we play. I know what you mean. And the training at Collins College takes less time than most people might think. Can you believe we get paid to do this? For a complimentary DVD, call 888-823-0999. Operators are standing by. That's 888-823-0999. Call now.
What is even in this stuff today? It's oysters. So I got this friend Mike, we used to study together at NYU. And he was always the real successful one, right? So anyway, Mike gives me a call the other day and he's like, Hey Hollywood, what's up? Are you famous yet? And I was like, dude, I just booked a, I just booked a job on this show called Pearl. <laughs> Must have killed him, right? I mean, sure, I get vomited on. But I'm on the TV set. Yeah, yeah, it's like game set and match. You're plugged into G4 Rewind. Going, going, gone! It's Adam Sessler and Morgan Webb. Welcome back to X Play. Yes, and now we're back. We're back. We've returned on. with the first 3D chapter of the legendary King of Fighters series. This 2D fighting series from SNK was the less popular alternative to Street Fighter 2. Now, Street Fighter is Bon Jovi to King of Fighters Tesla. <laughs> now, however, King of Fighters is going 3D. Is that a good thing? Find out as we review King of Fighters Maximum Impact. Well then. So I guess I'll start this. Yeah, I guess we have to. Ten years of SNK game history are on the line. KO. King of Fighters Maximum Impact is the first time this once winning 2D brawler has gone for all three dimensions. The graphics are cool, but the game still falls pretty flat. There are cool combos and stylish moves, but the story is even more paltry gobbledygook than it usually is in these games. Oh, you're so strong. Or is it? Let's take a moment to look deeper, to examine the emotional side of a fighting game. Look say. at these poor men, sadly sublimating their desires for one another with unhealthy, naked aggression. Sweat this time. Look at the new sibling characters, Alba and Sarimiera. Alba knows something is different about his brother and only wishes he would step out of the shadows of his violent closet. It seems you're hiding something from me. Sadly, they too swirl into this cycle of violence. Only this adamant wannabe has the courage to live as the man he really is. Well, and this guy, nice shorts. Or maybe I'm reading too much into this. You're just a straight dog, barking brainlessly like that. Also new this year are some womenly sexual stereotypes. Leanne Neville is an American-style dream, a body-gloved super spy so dangerous she could give herself a black eye while pounding her opponent into paste. Leanne, you do know why you're in this, don't you? Mignon Béart is the Japanese version. Cute, clad in either a cocktail waitress or kitty costume, you might think at first she escaped from another game. Get away! Get away! Get but as she skips and giggles her way to victory, it becomes obvious she belongs with the fighters. When the two meet, not only is it furious, flashy fisticuffs, it fulfills fantasies all over the world, simultaneously. My Mignon looks nice! Does Mignon look nice? Lonely programmer wish fulfillment aside, however, Maximum Impact is just not that exciting. You putz! Features hailed as all new have been standard issue on Virtual Fighter and Soul Calibur for years. No, sidestepping is not groundbreaking. The fighting is okay, but does nothing to raise the bar. We give it a two out of five. Idiot, idiot, idiot! That was the first 3D King of Fighters game, and hopefully it'll be the last, too. Of course, not all fighting games are bad. Some are excellent, like Soul Calibur 2 and the characters in it. They're, they're, they're really smart, like this guy. X-Play presents Stupid Fun with Soul Calibur. Fine. I accept your challenge. Is there really a Hitori Hanzo sword? And if so, where can I get one? Swords are not... Toys. Yeah, but can I buy one? So is that a yes? Damn it! Hey Mitsurugi, I keep getting beat up. What advice do you have for me? Don't cry. My question is stupid. You probably don't want to answer it. Try me. Should I get a master's degree in philosophy? Pretentious fool. Don't make me laugh. English major? <laughs> Communications? <laughs> what do you think about President Bush getting reelected? There will be no mercy. That's all for today. What a waste of time. Thank you for your answers. The name's Mitsurugi. Remember it. <laughs> Informative. Don't go away. When we come back, we review the goriest game of the year. Up 
next, graphic violence and skimpy outfits. Must be time for Blood Rain 2. You're plugged into G4 Rewind. Up next, X Play. Flush out the old, pour in the new. Get Advance Auto Parts 50-50 antifreeze for just $6.98 a gallon. Sale ends August 30th. So whatever you're working on, Advance will help you keep the wheels turning. In this home, a family grows. Children learn and play. Bonds are built. But before it was a house, it was a detailed drawing on a plan. The bachelor degree program in construction management in the School of Drafting and Design at ITT Technical Institute offers educational opportunities that can help students prepare for challenging and rewarding careers in the construction industry. There's a demand for individuals with knowledge and skills to manage construction projects. The construction industry needs professionals who can oversee construction projects in accordance with the plans and specifications. Thanks to the hard work and dedication of many, this dream became a home. There are still many more to be built. ITT Technical Institute School of Drafting and Design. Education for the future. To find out more, call 1-800-372-4052 or visit us on the web. The U.S. Army Reserve requires a different type of strength. The strength to stand out in school and stand strong with your team. The strength to serve your community one day and your country the next. The strength to take your career to a whole new level. Be a stronger citizen, a stronger soldier, a stronger person in the U.S. Army Reserve. There's strong, and then there's Army strong. See what it's like at GoArmy.com. Your teeth are a living part of your body. And over time, the enamel begins to weaken from the inside. But now you can help rebuild your teeth. New Trident Extra Care, the only gum with Recaldin, a unique form of calcium that penetrates into and strengthens tooth enamel. Trident Extra Care, chew strong. At eHarmony, we match you with other singles based on compatibility. And the best part is, you can review your matches absolutely free. Aren't you curious to see who you'd be matched with? Log on and review your matches for free. eHarmony.com Now you can get extra cash. Recycle your old gold that's gathering dust. Call the number on your screen for quick cash. The gold kit is absolutely free. Send broken and outdated items like old rings, charms, chains, and more. I got $1,000 for my old gold jewelry. It's safe, it's fast, it's easy, and the gold kit is free. We'll mail you a free personalized gold kit for safe shipping in our new virtually indestructible TrueTech mailer for maximum protection. Your check will follow promptly. I called and got my free gold kit. I sent in my jewelry and they sent me my check. The gold kit and postage are free. Your satisfaction guaranteed. Here's how it works. Call for your free gold kit, then gather your old gold jewelry, send it in the free postage paid TrueTech mailer, and get your cash fast. I'm going on vacation with the money I got for my old gold jewelry. Don't wait. Take your old gold jewelry and turn it into cash now. Call the number on your screen now or visit goldkit.com. This fall, the villains take over. Catch the latest episodes on Cable's Home for All New Heroes Season 3. Tuesday, starting this September on G4. We've returned with the goriest game of the year. It's the sequel to 2002's Blood Rain, which tells the story of a vampire girl with really large arm blades. Arm blades, yeah. That's... Here's our review of Blood Rain 2. Arm blades. 
my god, look at that. Good night, nurse. Ooh, that's definitely stimulating my economy. Do you like a little gratuitous violence in your softcore porn? Why, then you'll love Blood Rain 2, a game that proves vampires are really trampy. Never forget that. Oh, how could I when all the women in this game dress like this? I've been working on something. Yes, inappropriately attired vampire Rain returns for her second outing. But this time, she's not killing Nazis. She's killing a bunch of contemporary vampires who look like they robbed the local Hot Topic. And with the vastly improved graphics and ragdoll physics, the game is gorier than ever. I expect a number of horrible deaths tonight. And you'll get them. Where's my backup? Sure, there's a plot in this game somewhere, but it's not very good. Dead God, Zerx, it's horrible. But then, you aren't buying this for the plot. You're buying it for the killing and the gratuitous underwear shots. And, oh, sh okay, the killing. Don't mind that leg lying on the floor. That doesn't look very comfortable. Sure, you still have your handy dandy arm blade, but this time around, you also have a gun that shoots, what else, blood. And the harpoon returns. But now you can control where you fling the bad guys. I need help over here. Um, no kidding. You're on fire. It's a problem. There's also a smattering of Prince of Persia style acrobatics that let Rain jump and swing on poles like, well, a stripper. Add to this Rain's delightfully genteel dialogue. You lying rat sucking son of a bitch. You Nazi a the master can blow me, monkey suit. And you have a game that takes the mature rating to a whole new level. Some of the in-game kills are so graphic, we can't even show them to you. So we covered them with kittens. Oh, so cute. Another nice feature is that there's no crummy item collecting in this game. Switches and levers are so old school anyway. The only resource is blood. Don't stop. Oh, don't stop. Oh. Ah, did I mention this game was intended for adults? Ooh, we should have put that in gay games. Of course, the problem with Blood Rain 2 is that most of Rain's moves are totally unnecessary because the default slash 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 gets the job done every time. When you saw the blades, what did you think was going to happen? Well, almost every time. On the groin, people. The lady. No matter how much blood you spill, the bottom line is that Blood Rain 2 can get really repetitive. <laughs> Even if you spill a lot of blood. Because well, for some reason, the bad guys are chock full of it. It's like a sprinkler. If you're willing to branch out and try some of the more complex moves, you'll no doubt be impressed with how it all looks on screen. But while Blood Rain is pretty and pretty violent, it's also pretty shallow. We give it a three out of five. I'm going to destroy you. Um, no need to get personal about the score. Why don't you just go kill something? Aw, kitty! So cute. Hi, kitty. Meow, meow, meow. This must be my lucky day. Kittens are cute. Meow. Yes, they are. I never thought I'd say this, but I feel overwhelmed by cleavage today. Anyhow, what's coming up next is really, really stupid. I yes, mean, really stupid. It is really, yeah, it is. We're I gonna laugh. To you to enjoy it. We'll see you later. Good do with it. Good night. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> There's one show out there that keeps coming up. Pearl. Uh, it's good, unclean fun. Eat it! Eat it! The greatest gag reflex competition ever mounted. Don't puke, brother! Oh. Don't puke, eat more! It's gastronomic molestation. It will bring about the imminent destruction of the human race. Ah. Reality TV that's turning heads and stomachs. Pearl. All new Sunday at 7, only on G4.